Okay, the other day I did a video of kind of following me through a day of my managing labor and delivery as faculty, and I talked about a patient who had uh, polyhydramnios, which means excessive amniotic fluid, and that that caused more bleeding. This question says, why does extra amniotic fluid equal extra blood loss? It doesn't always equal extra blood loss, but it is a, it is a risk factor for what we call, uh, for what's called uh, uterine atony. The uterus is composed of smooth muscle. If you over distend the uterus uh, with extra amniotic fluid or a big baby or twins, anything that causes the size of the uterus to be bigger than it typically would be in a singleton gesta gestation, um, causes the muscle fibers to stretch more. And we need those muscle fibers to contract down to decrease the bleeding after delivery and after delivery of the placenta. So if it's been uh, over distended or stretched, overstretched with extra amniotic fluid, that means those muscle fibers will be, can be harder to contract down and control bleeding. And that increases the risk of uterine, uterine atony. So it's important that we know if a patient has a large fetus, if they have extra amniotic fluid, if they have a multiple gestation, other factors that predispose them to uterine atony, which can uh, cause excessive bleeding. I hope that answers your question.